Hello everybody, my name is Abdullah and today I'm going to show you my 7 segment display jumbo project. In this uh, project, I'm going to be using the 7 segment display, the IR receiver, and two TV remotes. So, in this um, like project, I'm going to be controlling this LED. So over here, let's see, let me show you my remote. There's like these numbers, 1, 2, 3, 4, until like 0, 9 till 0. So over here is a small like chart of this LED over here. So if I press 1, that will glow the one on the top. 2 for that, 3 for this, 4 for this, 5 for this, 6 for this, 7 for this, and 8 for this. So this is the uh, like controlling part. Now on to the code. So on the code, for each segment, like for each LED, there's two codes. So there's one to like turn it on and one to close it. And I'm going to be using the hex code for doing that. So let me explain what a hex code is. So normally what computer programmers use is called binary numbers, which is base two numbers, zero and one, which is pretty confusing. So what, what we use is you, we use hex code. Hex code is uh, quite simpler and it's pretty easy to use. Let me give you a small ex explanation. So over here, see 0 to 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Is the co is the like numbers we use base ten, which is the decimal, and over here, uh, as you see, there's sixteen, uh, sorry, fifteen numbers, which is base sixteen. So let's start. So or in hex code, you s from zero to nine, they're all equal to zero to nine. But starting from ten, it's A. Eleven is B. Twelve is C. Thirteen is D. Fourteen is E, and fifteen is F. So this is the difference between normal, like normal, like base ten and hex code. So onto the project, I'm gonna plug this in. Plug it. There we go. I'm gonna run it. It's running. Let's start. So I'm gonna start with number one. Number one is gonna glow this LED on the top. Number one. Um, see over there? There we go, number two. Should glow that one on the side. Yes, it did. Number three, it should glow the one on the bottom. There we go, number three, and there we go. Number four. There we go. Number five. There we go, number six. There we go, number seven. There we go. Oh, wait, sorry. There we go. And number eight. Small, a small dot. So this is all, like, all of the buttons to turn it on. No, all of the buttons to turn it off. So now I'm going to press one. Let me, uh, I guess, there we go. It's gone. Number two. Oh, sorry. Number two again. There you go. It's gone. Number three. There you go. Wait, sorry. It's not detecting. There you go. Number four. There you go. The down part is gone. Number five. There you go. Number six. Perfect. Number s oh, sorry, I didn't show. Number seven, also gone, and last for that small dot. And there we go, the whole thing's finished. Now let's make some numbers. So over here, I'm opening a chart. Um, there it is. So over here, let's. So what are we gonna use? I'm sorry. What are we gonna use? We're gonna use these. So the this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. I'm gonna make the number nine. So let's see. So this is number one. The one on top. Wait, wait. Oh, sorry. I'm using the wrong remote. One. There you go. Now I need two. There we go. Now I need three. Now I need six. Oh, sorry. And six. Now I need seven. I'm just gonna. 
there you go and there you go i made number nine so now if you want to shut everything down you just press this and everything's gone thank you everybody this is my jumbo project i hope you enjoyed bye bye